What's going on everyone, it's Rifle here, and thanks for checking out this Fallout 76 video. In this one, I was going to show you a secret area that you can get to inside the Blackwater Mine, which also has a pretty good event that sometimes happens here as well, it's called Uranium Fever. A couple legendary enemies spawn here that you have a chance at getting some good loot from. You know, that all depends on your RNG. Anyways, yeah, here's the location, so from Vault 76, it's just right down here. Look at everybody right here. At this place. This place is the spot. Anyways, inside this mine here, there's a flooded area, and you can go inside this flooded area and travel through the water, and eventually you'll get to a staircase. You can go up in the staircase, and it leads to a secret room. I'll be showing you that in this video. It's insane. I'll also be showing you a few things that you can loot and whatnot while traveling through this place. Hopefully you end up enjoying this video. And if you do, consider leaving a like. That's always greatly appreciated. And hey, maybe stick around and subscribe for more Fallout 76 content. That's always up to you, though. Okay, so keep in mind, there is going to be enemies, but... Yeah, let's go ahead and dive into this. Here we are at the entrance of the place. Let's make our way inside. So from the entrance, it's pretty straightforward to get to the secret area. After I show you the secret area, I'm also going to be showing you some other loot that you can get in this place too. Yeah, it's pretty much a straight shot. I'm going to rush my way through real quick. Bam. Oh, no you don't. Okay, so here's the spot. By the way, a good perk card to have, and we'll go ahead and get underwater here real quick. A good perk card to have on, I think I'm safe down here, is Aqua Boy or Girl, depending on what sex you chose. As you can see, it's over here in Endurance, Aqua Boy. You no longer take rad damage from swimming and can breathe underwater. Very handy for going to this secret area, or in general to use for underwater secrets. Now I know it is pretty dark over here, so you want to rewatch it if you get a little lost. But it's pretty much a straight shot, and there will be a staircase over here to the right that will lead into an open door. And this is the way inside the secret area within the Blackwater Mines. This is so cool. I love how they added these little secrets in like locations like this. I'm going to be showing off as many as I can find to you all. I'm going to make this like a little series showing off secret locations within the areas. But yeah. That is if there is more. If you know of any, feel free to leave them down below in the comments. It's totally up to you though. But yeah, here's the room. Pretty cool. I've already been in here and raided the place, I'm not going to lie. But yeah. Some over here that we can unlock. Bam. Got nothing out of that. That's what I'm talking about. There's a wall safe over here too. That you can pick. Oh, right. Heck yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Now, I just got nothing because I've been in here kind of recently. Or my RNG is just poo-poo. Hopefully you have better luck than I just had. I'm going here. Either way, cool spot to come and check out. And by the way, in case you're wondering um, what this giant hole here leads to, just pretty much takes you back down faster. See, it takes us back out. But I don't want to go back out quite yet. I'm going to go ahead and show you something else that you can do when coming here. Well, I really shouldn't say back out. It just takes us back into the mine instead of in this underwater area. By the way, if you keep going straight, that just leads to a dead end, so keep that in mind. Okay, so make my way back over here. Ooh. Desk fan, heck yeah. Ooh, and some wine. I passed up. Whoopsies. You know what? I also passed up this. Why not? Just take everything. Screw it. Because I don't think I'm coming back here for quite some time. 
Anywho, carrying onward. Here's another little area that you can search through. Ooh, Mr. Handy Fuel. Damn. Oh yeah, this is a banger to hit up for sure. I think that about does it. Now, to, as you can see, there's a ladder that you could take to go out of the area. Literally out this time. But yeah, as you can see, took us out up here. And you can enter back in if you want. Pretty sweet. But yeah, I want to go ahead and go back in. Show you some other things you can loot real quick. Alright, so when you first enter, some areas to be on the lookout for is in here. You can check around inside here. You can also take a decontamination shower through this area. Check the lockers. There's always contain something, it seems. I'm not going to try to pick up too much, but also you want to keep in mind to check up here. There's a safe that you can loot. This, of course, can be different for you. Once you've checked out those two areas, just make your way down to this area. There will be a few enemies, of course, here and there that you have to take on, but be sure to check up on top of uh, each side of here. There's something you can get on top of on each side and once again that's RNG but on down here is where the real fight will begin there's going to be a ton of enemies to take on I've already taken on quite a few let's just say that much but be sure to check up here first before you go on in as you can see a little room to loot but anyways now there's going to be a ton of enemies that will spawn here too a ton. I've already taken out quite a bit of them. There's still some. Okay. Oh. What the... There's gotta be a trick to get in there. Oh well. But yeah. At this area, there's a trunk that you can loot, too. And not to mention some plans over here. Be sure to also check out what's inside this security room. Get some pretty good stuff in here. Alrighty, so once you've checked that room, you then want to head this way, across the bridge. And there's a few goodies in here that you can check out. As you can see, a bobblehead here on the table. Shotgun shells. Combat shotgun, if you're into that sort of thing. And, yeah. Other, a few other little goodies. But yeah, as you can see, we're back here at the beginning. So, from here, when you jump down in the water, once again, it's useful to have that aqua boy or girl per card on. But there is a safe over here. That you can unlock. Requires zero skill level, so very easy to open up. But yeah, some secret loot that you might have passed up right there. And how you get out of here is just by simply exiting your power armor. You just float to the surface. But yeah, that's about wrapping up this video, everyone. Hopefully you found this enjoyable. And if you did, consider leaving a like. That's always greatly appreciated and helps out the video a lot. And also, maybe stick around and subscribe for more future Fallout 76 content. That's always totally up to you, though. Until next time, though. Thanks for taking the time to watch and listen. Peace.